Hello, Internet! I am Amara Smokinati, and welcome back to Born Into Fear. We're back! <laughs> it's been a tiny bit. Um, actually, it hasn't been too long since I played this, so thankfully, I'm uh, still in the loop, um, I think. Where are we at right now? We're at 110, 117. Okay, so we should go straight ahead to go over here. But, geez, I'm so scared of that. Okay, I need to go straight ahead. And this person needs to screw off. Okay, don't even notice me, buddy. Don't even look at me. She won't even have any idea. Until she turns around. In which case, that might be a problem. I'm gonna go ahead- what? Examine. Mail? Miss Ava's mailbox? I need to collect mail for her? Wait, what? Was that a thing? Okay, did she turn around? She has not turned around yet. Hey, lady! Hey, lady! Hey! You can't come up here, can you, sucker? That's right! That's right, you can't! Screw you! Seven out of seven. So wait, was there, is there another mission where I have to collect her mail? I don't get it. Unless that was like some kind of scrapped mission, in which case, okay, whatever. So to let her go past. And then we're good to go. We did find out some crappy stuff that ages, well, I mean, more than crappy, some horrible, horrifying, literally blood-curdling stuff that Aegis has been doing underneath this town? Neighborhood? Whatever the hell this place is called. It's, it's North Hollow Heights. They were underground torturing folks and doing some type of bullshit experiments with them to try to summon some kind of creature, which they we thought they were trying to get rid of, but in reality, they were just trying to summon it to make it come and attack people. And um, I guess not really attack people. They wanted to study it for some reason. What is this house? Uh-huh. Okay. Is someone gonna scare me? Please yep! Uh, who are you? Are you my mom again? Why are they all moms? Cleaning spray. I already have cleaning spray, but I will pick up stuff and clean as you wish me to. Why? Oh, there's someone out there creeping around. She taking a shower in there? Great. I'll clean while you also clean. Imposter games. Clean that off the wall. Is that like when some of the developers or something? Or like someone who made the game? Helped make the game or something? Oh no. Okay, please don't scare me. Can I come in? Knock knock, ma'am. Mother? Is that is that mother? I'm assuming it might be my mother. I, they're always my mom in this. Why? Someone had mommy issues when they were making this game or something, dude. Just gonna save that real quick. I don't trust nothing in this game, even though I haven't died yet. I feel like I probably could. Required item not in inventory. Oh no, Aegis report again. Oh no, I hate fridge. Oh, oh my! What the fuck? What have you been eating? A lot of chocolate ice cream, <laughs> apparently, and a lot of wine. That's the kind of life I want, man. Just eating, eating, I almost said eating wine. Drinking wine and eating ice cream all the damn time. That's amazing. This guy is amazing. Oh, here we go. Both targets were dead asleep when we entered the house. Doubt we could have woken them up if we wanted to. Hell, Agent Mouse stumbled into one of the bedroom doors and target inside didn't even mumble in the sleep. Anyway, our job here is done. Moving on to the next set of targets now. Here's hoping the rest of the night goes this smooth. Field Agent Talon. So you- So, wait, you killed them without sucking out their energy or whatever the fuck you do to these people? I'm confused. <clears throat> Excuse me. So, like, I'm gonna guess they- The buffer feeds off of negative energy. Which I guess, whatever, you know. Um understandable horror creature behavior 
roommate's letter. What does this say? We'll click. Bro, I'm feeling biology and philosophy this semester. You think that chick from Brad's party would be down to tutor me? Chloe something, I think it was. Anyway, if you get the chance to ask her for help, for, uh, ask her for me, would you? I can't find my phone after our party last night. Also, try and see if she's single. <laughs> well, like like you already said, that probably should be the least of your worries. You'd probably be worried about failing philosophy and shit. So I'm assuming this is like a college. Why is this not clean? There it goes. This is like a college roommate situation where they were just hanging out, drinking, and eating ice cream, and whatever the hell her name is is mothering him for some reason. <laughs> what are you eating? Were you were you eating ice cream in this shared home? What the fuck is that? By no what the hell? Binoculars. Looking at what? What is that? Is that a pool? What is that? I can't really tell what that is. Was he like creeping on the girl across the street? That's weird, dude. That say R modern architecture cool okay um y'all are weird y'all are really weird i i don't like that you're so fucking weird oh there it goes okay what else do i need <clears throat> excuse me collect and throw away beer bottles and clean the walls i need to clean one more stain on the walls where is that last stain Wait, no. Usually that's... Uh, oh, it's probably in the fucking bathroom. Or in here. There we go. This is the last stain. There's the beer bottle. Is she still in the shower? Can I come in? Oh, no. Okay, so now I need more beer bottles, right? I need one more. It's probably in the bathroom. Is it in the bathroom? Knock, knock. Hello? I'm not even gonna bother with that. Hey, is there beer in there with you? Are you drinking in the shower? Oh my god! Oh, you are my mom. What the fuck? Okay, so I can't actually look. Okay, so there's no beer bottle in there. That's fine. Whatever. Is this the last one we needed? Oh yeah, it is. Okay, never mind. So I actually almost peeked into her room for no into her naked shower body for no reason. <laughs> Sorry! That's my bad. What does, it, what does it say about... What is this house? Bachelor's pad. Two college students lived together here before the experiment. Mark was an engineering student at a local university. Is that a reference to Markiplier? Because wasn't he studying to be a bioengineer or something? Brad was studying philosophy at the community college in the next town. Neither will finish their degrees or start their careers because of ages. Is what we're attempting worth the sacrifice? Our target has asked me to clean the dirt off of the walls and throw away all the beer cans in the house. If I want to complete my mission, I'll need to do as she says. I cleaned up the house and became a gold star richer for my efforts. Now I have four. Mommy will be so proud. So wait. She... So there was only two guys... Right direction. At least I won't be very stupid. It's a lonely house with a mess. Who the fuck are you? Okay, so apparently she didn't even... That, this is a person who didn't even live here. Oh, God, okay. Okay, chillax. Chillax, bro. Chillax, bro. Man. <laughs> that kind of pose. She's like, mm, check this out. What the fuck? Get out of here. Please stop standing like that, you weirdo. Just leave. Just leave, please. Stop creeping on me. Hey. Please leave. Thank you. I'm gonna go ahead and save. So it appears that almost all of the Sallies, or whatever they are, take on a motherly... Well, maybe not exactly motherly, but like an authority figure. But it's like very classic, conventional motherly discipline, motherly scolding that we, we're seeing here, which is interesting. Are they like taking on... Are they inherently... Oh my fuck you! Fuck you! Oh my god. I'm talking here. Shut up. I'm talking about your weird food picnic thing. God damn. I'll do it for you because you have nice eyes. Um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, okay. So they all seem to take on like a motherly kind of um, 
like an over almost an overbearing motherly thing which is interesting to me this does not look reassuring it's kind of cool though i haven't really explored the backyard so i don't think you have to i don't think there's anything really out there j g is that another reference to the creators of the game cool is he in the toilet nope no monsters taking a dump anywhere in here okay where is the basket at? Is it over here? Oh, yeah, it is. Okay. Picnic basket. Throw everything in there. What else do I need? Three more items. But it's interesting because they all seem to take on that same um, uh, behavior. They all seem to be... Oh, yeah, this is that. Oh, we made it over here. Okay, yeah. That was the other entrance. That was the other entrance to that one place. To the underground area. Mm. Which I didn't really like that much because it was creepy! But it was good information down there, though. Last. Mm. Okay. What? What? Neither do I, to be honest with you. Origami. Cool. Picnic item. I'm I'm confused. Ugh. Is this another picnic item? More chips. So many chips. Is this the last one? Why is there sausage in your fucking What? Was that sausage? Why did you have like a <clears throat> a case of Jimmy Dean sausage in your freaking bed? Actually, do I want to know? Do I really want to know? Oh, oh my getting ready. Come on, let's go. I don't like you that much. Okay, enjoy that. Can I take this? Interact. I can't examine. Can I examine it? Okay, yep, okay, whatever. Cool, that was this house. Aegis Report. Mm. Targets were watching a movie in their living room when we entered the home. We were caught off guard by their quick reactions with Target <clears throat> Beta nearly escaping the perimeter of the house. Fortunately, one of our agents was on standby and managed to intercept the target before he escaped. Meanwhile, Target Alpha struggled, but Agent Johnson managed to maintain control of the situation. And soon, both Alpha and, Alpha and Beta were drowned in the bathroom. Beta's phobia of water might have made it more difficult for lesser agents, but we had no trouble. I hate this. I... I hate this. Ugh. Dude, it's really fucked up. Josh and Brandon Tayapad lived here together. If our background checks were correct, they met at a charity function for crippled children. The pair bonded over horror movies and were quickly married within a few months of meeting each other. The buffer has asked me to get a basket ready for a picnic. Okay, so that's the buffer. Everything's ready for the picnic and I've been awarded another gold star. Sally disappeared too. Well, wherever she goes, maybe she never leaves at all. So it's a buffer, but they call this variation of the, of it sally is that what's going on here i'm still not understanding all the technicalities here or anything i'm still very weirded out as well this is not great this is so fucking sad like dude it's so sad okay someone's gonna jump scare me wait no one did where am i House 108. Sven Cunningham was a programmer working for one of the tech giants. Huh. Wait, am I in an essential home? I am. This is essential, so why? There's gonna be a ghost in here. Aegis report. Save. What does this say? Intel on this house failed to mention the presence of pets inside. Two dogs all alerted the target, nearly allowing him to call the police. We had to deviate from the attendant execution reservation for the target in order to salvage the operation. Both animals were eliminated with gunfire during entry into the house. We were able to use their remains to disturb Mr. Cunningham enough to satisfy me before his death. I suggest that next time, targets are thoroughly investigated and documented for proper planning. <sighs> Oh, 
origami. Someone's gonna scare me. Mm -hmm. Dry dog food. Fuck, dude. I really hate... Uh, okay. Oh! <laughs> ah, she's back, baby! <laughs> what an entrance. Hey. Oh, she changed her mind. She's shy. It's okay. You can come out. We're not going to judge you. Oh. She left. Okay. I... <laughs> good oh my god that was no oh, that got me real good oh man at this point I'm not really scared of them well this needs to be closed that's not a good thing to have open oh god the dog oh it's the person brother Sven what the hell who are you what are you doing in my home uh, I'm just looking for ways to make up for what happened you can't make up for what happened. They killed us all. Everyone in the neighborhood, including even the pets. My poor dogs. I might not be able to fix it all, but I might be able to help you move on. Move on, huh? There might be something I've never got to do. Tell me. I'll do my best to make it happen. Okay. There's a woman who lives, or, well, lived, in, I guess, in House 105. Her name is Ava, and I'm absolutely in love with her. I even wrote her a letter, but I was too chicken shit to give it to her. If you could deliver this letter to her mailbox, it would mean a lot to me. I'll see what I can do. Are you tippy-tapping outside? Who's out there? Nobody. So that was what the mail thing was for. Oh! Oh! Okay, then. That's weird. Um, anything else? Age to poor, I already got that. Okay, so I just have to deliver this to, um, Ava mailbox. Ava's mailbox, that's it. Okay, let's go. <clears throat> let's go. Where was the exit again? How do I get out? Oh, right here. Okay. I'm gonna go across the street first. Don't look at me. Don't even think about looking at me. There we go. Close the door. Thank you very much. Oh, a ghost. Okay, let's please the ghost. Are you also in love with Ava? Wife's letter and package. What is his name? Don Roberto. Come to finish the job, have you? Not all Aegis agents are out to kill you. No, not all of them. Even one is too many for my liking. What have you come here for, then? I'm trying to ease the suffering done in this neighborhood. The fuck is that? Is that a- I thought it's a tree. And doing a shit job of it, huh? Hmm. Maybe I'm being too harsh on ya. You do look like you're trying to do some good here. If you really do mean it, I might have something I like done. Anything. My cousin was in an accident not too long ago. My family asking for some money to, send, to be sent to help out. Since I can't spend money anymore, can you find and gather up all the cash around the house? You need to put it in the box on the table and leave it in the mailbox after. Help lessen the pain in the world. Help my family. On it. What the f- Hi! How you doing? What's up? I don't like you. I really don't. Why are you gonna show up now? I'm doing stuff, man. I'm trying to lessen the suffering of these people. And you're just popping in. Saying, hi, how you doing? And there's no reason for it. My wife's letter. Not my wife, sorry, Roberto. Roberto, your dad called a few minutes ago asking if you can send more money this month. Manuel was struck by a moped crossing the road. Had to be rushed to the hospital. His bills are pretty expensive and the family is hoping we'll help them cover it. Sorry, I didn't wait until you got home to tell you, but those sleeping pills are finally hitting me. Okay, so I need to get all the money in the house and put it in that package. Are you going to help? If you're not going to help, you can leave. This is an important matter. For me and for everyone else. Oh! She moved. Did you move? Did you move? 
You you cannot. Don't you money? Can I crouch? Okay, there we go. All the money. Where's some more money? 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 Okay, where's the package at? Anything else? How many how much is there? Send him the money, please. Okay. Four out of five. There's one more piece of money laying around in this house. And I'm gonna find it. Whoop. Nope, that's not it. Is it over here? What, 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 what? Aha! Money! Uh. Oh! Uh. How are you doing that? There's two of you at once. Oh. Okay. Okay. I'll put it in the mailbox right after she fucking leaves. She leave? Okay. She leave? Okay, she left. Thank God. The crouch pick this up and put it in the mailbox. In the mailbox. There we go. And now he shall be happy. How are you doing? Are you good? I hope it'll lessen the blow. Whoa! Okay. I did it. I got it. House 109 is all done. Roberto Santos immigrated here with his wife a few years ago from Guatemala. His mother was furious with him for marrying a woman below him, and so he left his country to make a new start. He was still in contact, trying to mend broken bridges with his family before the experiment. Roberto had hidden money throughout this property while he was still alive. He's asked me to gather it all in the box and home to his family. I'll have to search the whole house, maybe even the shed, if I want to help him. I left money in the mailbox. I have to make sure it gets to Guatemala. Gets, gets on to what gets sent on to Guatemala after I finished the mission. Roberto has disappeared, but hopefully he's moved on to whatever's next. There's a shed out back. They haven't done this yet. So 105 is over here. So I need to go across the street to the second left house. Whoa! Wrong button. Ah! Uh, you doing yoga there, man? Oh, you're doing like a, ba a ballet bow. Nice ass. <laughs> what the fuck is happening here? Are you done being creepy? I assume not. I'm gonna leave now. You good? You gonna um, hang out? I'm gonna, uh, bye. Okay then. I'm gonna head. Okay, she's heading towards me. But it's okay, because I got the power of crouching on my side. I got the power of crouching anime and god on my side. Uh. Okay, I need a juker. Juker, real good. One, oh, God. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Please. Please leave me alone. You're out of your range now. Uh-oh. Okay, she's still after me. My dogs are barking. It's going crazy up there. This house, right here. Screw you. Alright, sorry about that little jump cut there. They're still kind of making a fuss. Okay. Can you not? Alright. Listen here, ma'am. Listen here. I don't want no bullshit from you. My dogs are barking upstairs and they are making a real fuss because my dad got home. Hey, listen. <laughs> the music got really intense all of a sudden. She's already seen me. I don't think... Yeah, I don't think it's gonna make a difference. Uh, let's see. House 108. I need to head back and let him know I finished the delivery. Yes. 108. That's the one we need to go to. All the way back. All the way back to being chased around. There's two of them now! Would you guys get out of here? I need to go that way. I'll wait until they have moved. Oh, they're coming back. Oh, they're coming back. I was about to go make a run for it, but I cannot because they are running. They're coming back. Okay. Okay, we're sneaking behind her. She has no idea what's gonna 
come flying by in a second. And that one, too. Are they all the same entity? Like, different branches of the same entity? Like a hive mind? Or is it like they're all individual ones that look the same? Is that what's happening here? I'm gonna run for it. Okay. Up there is like our main goal, I believe. Okay, she's right next to the one I need to go to. She is right next to it. Go, 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 and go. Okay, we're here. Close the door. Tell him I sent it. Where is he at? There he is. Hey, buddy. I'll probably never reach her, but it's still enough for me. Yeah. All right, you have been helped. Well, I left it in Ava's mailbox. I don't know if she'll be able to read it in her current form, but I think Sven appreciated it either way. I just hope there wasn't anything too weird in that letter. I I think that's probably the least of our worries right now. All right, so 113, 114, 116, and 115 are all... Well, 117 as well, but they are all on the list. And I believe maybe we'll leave that for next time because I don't want this to be too long because I have other stuff to do as well. And so far... We're getting, we're getting to the meat of this story, man. We're really getting there. We've done over half the map, I believe. Yes, we've done over half the map. And I am very excited to see what else there is in store in this game. I mean, the scares are getting me, dude. The scares are getting me. Like, the jump scares and stuff are really ramping up. I think the further we get in the game, the more they're going to be crazy. I don't think you can die in this game. I don't know, I haven't died yet, so I keep saving, but I, I just want to keep saving just in case, because you never know. We have five golden stars, that's amazing if we were on Yelp, but we're not on Yelp, so <laughs> it doesn't really matter, I guess. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please, if you if you want to see more of me, feel free to subscribe. If you would like, I really appreciate it. And make sure to hit the like button if you enjoyed this video, it helps me, um, motivate me to make more of these and it also shows me you enjoyed it so i guess that's all from me and i love you guys so much and i hope to see you guys next time but if i don't see ya good afternoon good evening and good night